So today is day two of my COVID symptoms, and I had a fever of about 30.1 degrees centigrade running from last night. Then I took an ibuprofen, then it fell down, and then the fever spiked up to 38.6 this morning again at around 7 a.m. Central Eastern Standard Time. And um, now it's it's back up to 38.6, and I took another ibuprofen. Now uh, I'm taking an expectorant um, cough syrup, which essentially is just going to uh, thin the mucus in my um, from the post nasal drip in, in my throat and the back of my no uh, in the back of my throat. And um, so, so, so those are the expectations from the cough syrup. There's a, yeah, the intense headache still there. Uh, not as bad as yesterday, but the body aches ranging or, or spanning the, the thoracic and lumbar spine are very, very intense. And now just a fun fact, those uh, pains, they tend to be from a, a immunological signaling molecule called interleukin-6. Uh, and essentially what interleukin-6 does is, if you're into immunology, it helps promote the expression of major histocompatibility complex 2 receptors on dendritic uh, cells so that they may present more antigens to more T cells, or that is, naive T cells, to convert them into their designated helper um, or uh, cytotoxic uh, T cells via differentiation. So interleukin-6 plays a very important role, but it is, um, yeah, I mean, you don't really have the energy to think about it when your fever spikes and when the fever gets down again, back back to normal 37.3-ish degree centigrade. Um, these things, they just go on their own way. But yeah, coughing's still there. Um, wet cough, a little bit of a wet cough now because of the expectorant syrup that I mentioned earlier. But yeah, other than that, uh, not much is going on, not, nothing new.